Okay. Uh, so I have the honor of introducing the senior class today. Uh, but before we start talking about the class, I just wanted to uh, take a moment and acknowledge the amazing um, Ganesh is one of the lead coordinators here, and uh, over the last couple of years, he's been very focused on getting student feedback and using that to uh, continue to drive us to improve the senior class and also the high school curriculum in many ways. So I'm hoping that that's coming through uh, and impacting the students better. I also feel very fortunate that we have teachers like Sudhir and others who uh, are part of this uh, uh, center and teach. Uh, it's not just the students, but also I gain a lot from our daily conversations and the insight that he brings to the conversation every week. But enough about the center. Uh, let's uh, talk about the, uh, the guest, uh, the main event here. Uh, the class of 2020. This is uh, a special class in many ways. I think this is a class, I think this is one of our biggest senior classes. Uh, but beyond that, I think this is a class that has been engaged, at least in the senior year, they've been engaged all through the very end. Uh, typically, once the uh, acceptance letters come in from the colleges, we see a little bit of a drop off. Uh, among the seniors, but this year it was quite the contrary. We had 100% attendance uh, right till the very end, and I think that tells you a little bit about the the caliber of this class. Uh, this class has been in our program for a very long time. Uh, almost all of them have been with us uh, from middle school middle school onwards, uh, all through high school. But some of them have been in our program right from pre-K. Uh, I was talking to my wife, Janaki, and she remembers teaching some of these kids in pre-K. Uh, and upon reflecting with her about this class, the one thing we agreed was this is a class that keeps uh, the teachers on their toes uh, with their insightful and imaginative questions. So. Uh, I think that was true even in pre-K, and I think it's true even during their senior year. It, it has been an incredible experience to have the last year uh, with them. This is a class that has a very strong moral compass rooted in empathy and volunteering uh, and seva. They have been very active in all the volunteering activities uh, at Chinma Mission whether it's summer camps or uh, CORD USA fundraising and volunteering activities. The people you see in this room are the ones who have been leading those efforts over the last couple of years. Uh, and uh, and you know, they have already left a mark uh, on Chimay Mission. This is a class with high ambition and passion uh, and will change the world in their own unique ways. Uh, all of them have gotten into programs uh, in uh, very prestigious universities across the U.S. in the programs of their choice. And their passions range from filmmaking to math, medicine, and political science. I'm confident that this is a class that's going to change the world for the better. And, uh, and that gives me hope because uh, right now in this, uh, in this time period that we're in, we need leaders like them to step up and make a difference. So with that, I'm going to ask uh, the, uh, the, each of the graduates to come and say a few words and share their plans and their experiences that they've had in Bali Bihar. We're going to do things slightly different today because of uh, social distancing. I'm not going to introduce each of the, uh, the graduates. Uh, you know, we'll just uh, come one at a time and they'll say a few words and then we'll give them uh, the certificate and the Bhagavad Gita. So Asim, if you want to come up and over there, I just want to sit there and we can get started. Uh, while they're get coming up, I also want to acknowledge uh, the fantastic team that uh, pulled 
this event together. So we are all able to be here uh, in person with this graduating class while our family and friends uh, can attend uh, world over uh, on the web. Uh, so they have been working hard at it over the last couple of uh, weekends. So thank you, Jagan, Srinivas, uh, Ganesh, Shubha, Ramkumar, and others who really uh, put a lot of effort in pulling this together.